mothers who are upset with the way their children behave. Joining us now is Mary. She's devastated that her 15-year-old son, Pedro, slept with four girls in one day and claims to be a sex machine. She says she's worried about him and cries all the time. Before we hear from Mary, let's take a look at what Pedro said to me before the show. Pedro, what do you expect from these girls that you date? I expect, if I'm hungry, I expect to get fed. If I'm cold, I expect to get a new jacket. If I'm broke, I need some cash. If I feel like having sex, we need to go to the house. So you have to get something from them in order to have sex with them? Yeah. If I don't get nothing, you don't get nothing. And that's just how it got to be from hmm. Cali. Hmm. Well, Mary, Pedro is waiting backstage in isolation. He can't hear what you right now, but we'll, he'll be joining us in a minute. Yeah. You're, you're tearing up. What's going on? Because I'm frightened for him. Because Pedro's my baby. Okay? Who, who took your baby? No, he's my baby. And Angel's going to take my baby. Okay? He shows no, girls no respect at all. Okay, you heard him. I didn't raise him like that. I don't want him to be like that. Did you teach him about sex? Um, we've had all the AIDS talks, all the STD talks. And what does he say when you talk about this? All the preteen, let's get the condoms. You know, I mean, I was willing to even get his girlfriend's phone, you know, things like this once I found out that he was sexually active, okay? You know, Pedro says, don't worry about it, Mom. Hey, I'm a dog. That's he's, what he tells He's him. proud to be a dog. He's a proud to be a dog. Was his father like this? Or no, his father's not like this. A male figure? I mean, I'm, I'm wondering where he, he picked up this behavior. He has a father behavior. figure for 14 years in his life. A very good, firm, strict father figure. Okay. Well, hopefully we can reach your son today. Let's get Pedro out of the isolation booth and bring him out. <laughs> Pedro. Hello. You know, your mom was out here crying. She's very upset with the way you've been behaving. Really? What do you have to say for yourself? I don't know. It's man on my business, I guess, you know. It's I your business, but yeah, you... it's my business. I don't involve it with her. I you try have to not... be more responsible having sex. You have to be more careful. You have to be attentive to the young lady. You have to show her respect. What's going to happen? I'm not going to have my son at 20 years old. I'm going to go visit him in a grave. Come on now, man. Oh, no. What, do you think that AIDS isn't going to happen to you? That you're special? No. Then but why aren't you practicing safe sex? I do, but now. How can you have sex with girl, four girls in one day and claim you had safe sex with each and every one of those young ladies? What kind of young ladies do you go with anyway? They must not have any self-respect anyway. Okay, let me ask you this, Pedro. How would you feel, how would you feel if your mom was with a man that treated her the way you treat these girls? How would you feel? Upset, but now she's not, you know? And how I treat the girls is my business, and it's their business too, because they like me. It's gonna be everybody's business. AIDS goes from one partner to the next partner to the next partner to the next partner. They think it's a joke. Yes, sir, come on over here. Yes, I would like to know, have you ever saw an AIDS patient? Yeah. Yeah, it's no, it's no sight, man. So you should think about that. on me. But I mean, it, this is ridiculous. You guys can change your behavior starting now. Okay, now I'll start using more condoms in. Whatever. That's his attitude. Oh, Whatever. And it seems like you have a death wish. You know, when you make love to a woman, it's supposed to be tender and respectful. It's supposed to be intimate. Yes. Um, I'm a teenage girl, and if any guy ever treated me the way that you treat these girls, I think that they're a disrespectful piece of garbage. That sounds... That's good for you. That's good for you. I'm not... I don't... 